Hello YouTube, Wes here checking in with uh, Vinyl Inbox. Today we have some VCLT from across the pond. This is some VCLT from my friend Stefan over in Holland. He contacted me recently and said he wanted to send send something my way and I was, I was surprised and appreciative and uh, just arrived here the other day, wanted to do, film an unboxing, film my, my initial impressions of what he sent and share it with all of you. That's, what, that's the most fun thing about VCLT is not only do I get to experience the enjoyment of it, but all you do too, and Stefan gets to see my, ex my enjoyment as well. So that's a, it's just a great thing and, and a great thing that we all share these sort of VCLT unboxings here on YouTube because it, it, it not only, it not only benefits the receiver, but also the giver and everybody else gets something out of it as well, which makes it even better. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this package and see what Stefan sent. If you're not already subscribed to Stefan's channel, uh, I'd highly suggest you subscribe to his channel. Uh, does some great videos, keeps it really nice and short, uh, really informative. If you like my ability to sort of experiment with things uh, that may be sort of outside my wheelhouse, he is very much the same way. He's willing to give things a try. Uh, does a lot of thrift store shopping as well. And finds some really cool stuff and shares a lot of cool stuff and uh, talks about new releases and flipped open here. Sort of a style of a record box I'm not used to. <laughs> Not sure exactly how this one opens. Okay, got several things in here. First thing I see in here is a button, so I'll go ahead and open that up. It is a Mojo magazine, obviously going to be far too tiny for you to see. Um, so there's that. Very cool. A nice Beatles related postcard here. Uh, it says, Hi Wes, here's some VCLT from Holland. I've included two records from my country and two from Germany. I hope you'll enjoy them. I've been enjoying your videos for a long time and hope that you'll keep on making them. Take care, my friend. Greetings, Stefan73. Uh, thank you. I've been enjoying your videos for years as well and uh, hope you keep making them as well. And I'm glad. There was a time when you weren't making videos for a while, and I understand that, but I'm glad you're back now, and I'm glad you're making regular videos. It's uh, great great to see your face and see what you're finding and hear about uh, the music you're finding because a lot of that stuff is not a, not sort of well-known here in the States, so that's really cool uh, to sort of see that. Some stickers here, Docs Records. Sticker for the uh, Paradiso Vinyl Club. This is a vinyl club that he's subscribed to where he gets a, I it's a seven inch every month that they do a special seven inch pressing, uh, kind of neat. Uh, so I like that. Next thing I got here is a CD from Mojo Magazine. This is Return to the Star Club. I was actually just recently listening to the Beatles at the Star Club uh, vinyl release. So that's pretty cool, but you got uh, uh, the Platters and Gene Vincent, Carl Perkins, Buddy Holly, uh, Chuck Berry, Ink Spots, Billy D. Williams, 15 tracks that powered the Beatles in Hamburger. Well, I guess a lot of the songs that they were doing at the Star Club uh, done by other artists, maybe the original artists or maybe another artist covering those songs. So really nice, I'll have fun listening to that. Cool, okay, this first one, I'm not sure how to pronounce this. Uh, Prima Tanz Music, German Rock 82. He says this is German New Wave. And it's all in German. I can't even. I can't read any of the titles here. It's uh, yeah, but it looks really cool. Uh, some German new wave. I'm sure it will be will be very rhythmic and very electronic. So it should be really cool stuff. Look, definitely digging. Gonna dig this. It's on the Reflector Z label. Cool German. My first German 10 inch. I always love German pressings and a German 10 inch of, of new wave kind of stuff. So yeah, I mean, definitely going to dig this for sure. Okay, next thing we have here is a piece of Dutch psych pop. This is Bodwin de Groot with Picnic or Picnic. That's a really cool psychedelic cover, isn't it? That's awesome. The guy's holding the album cover and then, you know, it keeps, keeps going and going and going, infinity kind of thing. Really awesome on the DECA label. Uh, yeah, that looks really cool. Like, 
definitely looking forward to hearing some of this stuff. Uh, it says the lyrics are in Dutch. Is on the Deco Records label. Very nice. <laughs> this next one, he has a note says, "No need to explain." Obviously, this is Carl Schulz of Tangerine Dream. This is his album Dreams. Uh, 1986 is the date on this one, and yeah, I, I love the I love the hell out of Klaus Schulze, and I'm sure I'm gonna I'm sure I'm gonna dig this one as well. Uh, yeah, really cool looking, and this should be on the Brain label, he says, which makes sense. Uh huh. It's the Black Brain label. Recently showed one of those in the uh, vinyl inbox month or two ago that I picked up in a local store here uh, but this is an album I don't have from Klaus Schulz so a, thank you very much Stefan okay and the next thing he has included here is another Dutch group this is Dutch post-punk he says it's edgy and pretty cool this is by the visitor titled transparent world really nice looking I like the uh, photography on that and like the the aesthetic of it all looks really cool very spacey here looking on the back it's nice there's the label on that custom label on top hole records yeah obviously not something I'm gonna find in the States probably so very very cool uh, so thank you thank you thank you so much Stefan I, I, as I said I've always enjoyed watching your videos that was enough you didn't have to send me anything but I really appreciate it I've already started working on a package of stuff to send you uh, Hopefully get that out to you. It might be after the holidays, once I get that done, once I get it all together. There's a lot going on right now, but I'm really appreciative. Thank you again. Thank you for sending me these things. Thank you for thinking of me, and I uh, hope you all enjoyed it, and I uh, hope you all check out some of this music for yourself. I'm sure there are samples available online somewhere where you can find them if any of this looks interesting to you. Uh, so thanks for watching. Have a great day, great night, and we'll see you again next time. Cheers.